as 2023 election you know fast approach apc plots to extend buhari's tenor through or shibaju malami ticket bang Boshe has declared a shifting of the new nigerian people's party nnpp and national coordinator concerned advocates for good governance cagg barrister olushegun bang Boshe esquire on friday claimed that the ruling all progressive Congress APC has concluded plans to extend the tenor of President Mamadou Buhari come 2023. He said the party wants to achieve this through the cabals, which, according to him, has zeroed down on Oshibaju Malami ticket tentatively. The senior lawyer further claimed that the national leader of the party, Bola Ashibaju Tinumbu, has been rejected on two grounds. He warned that Nigerians must be aware of this distardedly uh, plan and stand against it, adding that Oshibaju government will further worsen the economy and political con uh, situation of this country. Given him, Tinumbu, the APC ticket will certainly offer the status quo which commenced with Oshibaju's administration in times of religion, he told Daily Post. He, Oshibaju, as a Christian, had Atiku, a Muslim, as his running mate. It's widely accepted that Buhari, being a Muslim, should ordinarily be succeeded by a Christian president. Secondly, and the most pronounced reason why Tinumbu has been ruled out is that in the history of politics in Nigeria, there has never been a time that a Northern Christian represented the interests of the North as per president or presidency. I sincerely doubt if they will change that status quo because of Ashiwa Jubola Ahmed Tinumbu. In other words, uh, barring a last minute change, Ashiwa Malami ticket has been endorsed by the power brokers in APC, all progressive Congress. However, the endorsement is meant to extend Buhari's tenor by proxy. Oshiba Joe won't be allowed to create any meaningful impact as president and will always be remotely controlled by some cabals in the government. He will also pay homage to Buhari and the cabals in anything he does. Professor Oshiba Joe has not been so useful as vice president. He has not been able to secure the release of Leah Shaib to date. The rest of the students of Bethel Baptist students are still in the den of the abductors. One would have expected him to ensure their releases, but he has been mute to the delight of the Kabas and presidency. He who has seen him as an obedient servant, he has failed to behave like. Biblical Esther who rescued her people from destruction even at the risk of her being killed by the king. The, the one millionaire request, uh, question is if he could not perform as vice president, how sure are we that he will perform as president when the same cabals will still be at the corridors of power? The APC has also considered the enormous influence of Pastor Adiboye before zeroing down on Oshiba Ju. The choice of Malami is strategic. He is almost the leader of the cabals at the presidency and will be in a position to effectively checkmate or shibaju if their plans works out. Nigerians should be aware of this uh, dastardly plan by APC to further worsen the economy and political situation of this country. The situation under Oshibaju will be worse because he won't be allowed to be effective just as Garuba Shewu has on several occasions took over his responsibilities. Nigerians must stand up to say no to this grand conspiracy to extend Buhari's tenor by proxy. We should reject any form of the third time bid for Buhari. Mm. Even if uh, Bangbushi is not even saying anything concerning this, mm, I believe Nigerians at large know what is good for them. They know what is rightly good for them. You and I know that the uh, administration of President Muhammadu Buhari has not allowed Oshibaju to be effective as he sought or is ought to be. 
as a professor, as a learned, you know, colleague in the, you know, uh, even if not in political realm, but as a senior advocate of Nigeria, he has the 101% right, you know, to, you know, uh, delve into uh, what's called politics and also delve into the affairs of the government. But as it is I've said that Garo Bashew has taken his place when it comes to, you know, representing the president. Uh, why would a spokesperson um, speak for the presidency? Why the vice president has not spoken? Why would the AGF represent Buhari when we have a vice president that could represent Buhari in speaking? Was that not the reason why Oshibajo was you know, given the mandate to become the vice president as a learned person who he is uh, a professor at that level? He was being, you know, dejected or rejected or uh, subjected to you know backyard door Oshibajo as a professor does not even speak does not even say anything the only time he could even you know speak up and represent Buhari was when the first you know uh, medical trip Buhari went for in London he was able to do one or two things but the long run the cabas you know put us together and probe him for you know accountability uh the traders money that he you know spent and delivered to the people of uh, the north the south because he was you know asked to make account for the ten ten thousand naira he shared you know mean that he shared it you know he was sharing it hand to hand and there was no account for that he said he was he was uh, just sharing the money basically you know how it went share the money you know hand to hand and there was no account for that he couldn't you know uh, make accounts for such you know money at the long run he was probed and silenced if not Oshibaju he does not even know anything about politics he would have been you know so effective till now but not only the trader money was he probed for but i believe uh, the cabas knows what they are really doing Yes, before we leave this page, I would like us to hear okay, one or two things. Uh, some comments are uh, you know, given to us here. Oshibajo is tied to Tenobu appendage and won't be controlled by any cabal. His boss, Tenobu, is also a powerful cabal. Well, everybody with his or her own opinion, what is your own? All the nonsense written to discredit Oshibajo cannot hold. Oshibajo will be a better president for the country than anyone you can think of, including anybody. Hmm. Okay, Malami is the dead weight of the duo. Oshibajo is okay, but get him a better northern pair. Plus, why deny Igbo the presidency? All those, they can't be not good enough. Well, why can't Bangushi pay more attention to his non exist party instead of dumbling into the affairs of another party? Well, what I believe is that if APC brings out Oshibajo, I believe no one is ready to vote in APC. Uh, if they will manage, they will only manage the PDP, not PDP rather, if a new party comes in. And as it has been said, the youth are ready for Nigeria because there won't be election either in the south, southern part of the country or in the country in general. Well, what is your opinion and what do you have to say about this?